Hello, happy new year. Welcome to 2023. I hope the end of your year was lovely. And now I'm back to it. I have a couple of orders that I'm going to fulfill. So one is I need to make a run of 12 mugs for a local deli. This will be my third run of mugs for them. I'm trying to be a major planner girl this year because I am dedicating all my time and energy to my photo business and my ceramics. So I'm trying to just like slowly pick up things versus just, yeah, having to do it all at once. So just more focused work and less scattered, even though me as a human is scattered, but that's okay. I also brought my wheel inside because I think everyone everywhere was really freezing for a bit. So even in Florida, it was too cold to be throwing outside. And now I kind of like it because I've been throwing in the evenings the past couple of days. Such a nice little wind down task. Like I just threw like five, like, okay, I didn't throw five things. I threw like 10, but it's because I was in such a groove and it felt so nice that I was like, well, I'll just keep going. I'm in charge here, so just trying to like get out of the nine to five mindset and still create a boundary of like break time, but the start stop be whenever I need it to be. And in a way that I'm still getting all of the things that I need to get done, but I'm not exhausting myself in ways that I don't need to just because I'm trying to fit it in this time constraint that isn't how my brain or my creative process works. Here's to 
Okay. I love it. Haven't thrown a vase in a while. It's a little off kilter, just how I like it. Hello. It's Thursday. I don't remember when I started this video, but I do know that I just got some scents from Makesy. You can pretty much order supplies to make a lot of like candles, soaps, they have all sorts of fragrances and you can even get vessels and stuff, but I just get the wax and the oils from them. And then I make them all myself. I love it when I get good packaging that I can reuse. Two new scents, a bunch of wicks. I launched a little subscription called Wonky Tonk where four times a year you get a piece from me or pieces depending on what I'm making. I just after last year wanted a little specific adventure where I could just play. I can try out new ideas, I can redesign old ones and like contain it to this special program where people can get stuff, add it to their collection, give it away for to someone else for a gift. I should smell these first. This smells like you're on vacation, probably a beach vacation, but it's like cool outside and you're drinking an ice cold glass of water with lemon in it and eating sorbet. Probably like coconut sorbet. I don't know if that actually is an accurate description, but that's where my mind went when smelling this and it smells delicious. Okay. <laughs> this, <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing, but it's because it's, I got this one because in the description it said sexy, spicy, and extremely nicey or something like that. So they hooked me with their little caption because I love wordplay. But this smells like Le Labo Santal. I don't remember the number. Love that place and every time I go to New York I go in there and wash my hands with what is essentially this scent. <laughs> oh my god! Okay, that's very exciting. I also am interested to see if I combine them what that smells like. Okay, now that I'm done with my candle novel, I feel great. I probably won't start making candles ASAP. Obviously, I don't have any pieces finished at the moment or any candle vessels even. I have one left over that I'm going to use as my test so that I can make sure I get the throw and the ounces of scent to wax right and all that stuff. I really do feel like a scientist whenever I'm making candles in my kitchen and I love it. Who knew? And now I'm going to finish trimming some mugs for my first commission and then I need to throw two bases today. Threw one yesterday, my god, what a struggle. The play was too hard. I knew it was, but you live, you learn. My camera died, are we surprised? I just talked for 10 hours. Well, I will probably sign off here. I am happy to be back at filming my whole process. I'm excited to be able to see my little wonky evolution for 2023. Thanks for watching. Have a nice time doing whatever it is you're doing.